Let's look at the solution for our 1-bit history quiz. We have a 1-bit history that starts at 0 and 2-bit counter for each possible history. All counters start at strong not taken. And the pattern we're trying to predict is the not taken, not taken, taken, etc. After 100 repetitions of this pattern, what is the total number of mispredictions that we will have seen? One way to approach this problem is simply to work through the table like we have seen before. So we will have our state, the prediction, the outcome, and whether we are correct. And now we will just work through the outcomes. The outcomes will be n, n, t, n, n, t, etc. And of course, we will not go through 100 repetitions of this. Pretty soon, the predictor will start to be very consistent about what it's predicting in each round of the pattern. The state initially is 0, strong not taken, strong not taken. The prediction as a result of that will be use the zeroth counter, which is saying strong not taken, so the prediction will be not taken. Disagrees with the outcome, so we are correct. Update the predictor, so the state will be zero because the outcome was not taken. Strong not taken will be updated with a not taken outcome, so it stays strong not taken, and the other counter just stays the same. Now the predictor again will predict not taken using zero and strong not taken, and it will again be correct. So the history stays at zero, the strong not taken stays at strong not taken, and the other counter just stays the same, and at this point, we will again, with a history of zero, use this, predict not taken strongly, and be wrong this time. So after one round, we have a single misprediction. The history will be one now, and the predictor here will be updated to weak not taken, because there has been a taken outcome, and the other predictor just stays the same. Now we will use a history of one to index, say, strong not taken, so the outcome will be not taken and be correct. Next, we will keep the strong not taken here. The other counter stays the same. The history becomes zero because of this. And we will use a history of zero to index into the weak not taken state and thus predict not taken again. Again, we are correct in our decision. Next, the history stays zero because the decision was not taken. The update of the weak not taken goes back to the strong not taken because the decision was not taken. The other counter stays the same. And using the history of zero, we will index and use this counter. This counter says strong not taken, so we will predict not taken. This will disagree with the taken prediction, so we will have a misprediction. This concludes round two. As you can see, at the end of round two, we have the same state that we had at the end of round one, so now pretty much what happened in round two will repeat more times. Overall, in the hundred repetitions of this, in each repetition we have a single misprediction, so the correct answer is that we have a hundred mispredictions, or one-third of our decisions are wrong. As you can see, the one-bit history predictor is not a great predictor for this type of a pattern.